Well, the U.S. Marshals Services has taken over this case and the FBI has set up a command center. Now, authorities in Nevada, specifically the county where Las Vegas sits, says they have been told that Vance may be going to or through that area. It has expanded uh, to really a nationwide manhunt. Sheriff John uh, Wetzel we says there's no information that shows Michael Vance is in or out of the state. That's why the feds were called. He could be trying to make it to Mexico or in California. Calling him an armed stone cold killer. Agencies are checking every single tip that comes in. My message would be to him is to give up. Um, we're going to catch him. Meanwhile, in Luther, the survivors of Kay and Ron Wilkson are getting ready for their funeral Friday with concerns. It's a little bit of everything. Uh, you know, we're all, you know, very sad that this happened, uh, but we're also real concerned for our own safety. The service will be held at the school auditorium. School is canceled for the day. Expect high security. We're going to have um, a lot of police on hand. Um, we're not going to let this guy break us. The sheriff urging all Oklahomans not to let the guard down. If you have a firearm in the home, make sure you're familiar with how to use that firearm. And a special hotline has been uh, made to specifically get tips on Vance's whereabouts. That number is 405-246-9205. We're live at Memorial and Quail Springs Parkway. Patty Santos, KOCO 5 News.